how to block a customer on shopify hi guys welcome back today i'm giving you a quick tutorial on how to block a customer on shopify so let's get started first what you guys need to do is you will open up your shopify store and you'll get right here this is my shopify admin and i'll show you how to block a customer on shopify so that they cannot order from your store if there is a fraud or any scam that you want to block it's actually really easy to do how to do that you will open up your a shopify app store this is a shopify app store you're gonna search for fraud filter once you search for it this is where you will get now this is our application here fraud filter by shopify create custom filters to help you prevent fraud and you will click on install app you can see i have already installed it and it's completely free once you add it and you connect it to your shopify then you will be able to find it in your settings and you just have to go to your apps and channels here you will find your fraud filter app. so let's open it up and create a filter to block a customer or to actually block a fraud so i'm going to open it up so this is what it looks like we can create a new filter click on add filter and now we can give our filter a name so let's just call it block customers all right so the first one is going to be cancel order or warning like what do you want to do with this filter uh, we can add anything i just went with this text and because it will help me remember why i created this filter so in action we can image cancel the order that meet the rules below or we can give a warning to you know that customer that this is their last warning if they do this again then they will be blocked now rules this is how i want to send them the rules we can send them an email landing site then we have like billing address company everything this is going to be the operation is not and you know the rule for example email the operation is is not and this is where i will add the value it's not verified it's not up to the mark so this is where you will actually create a rule and if they break this rule then they will be considered as a fraud or they will be blocked then we have options restock product inventory now this is for my own uh you know admin if i want to restock the product that they were actually going for send cancellation email or refund transaction amount so now it depends on me if i want to do a refund to them if i want to send a cancel email or if i want to just restock the product inventory so that's what i'm gonna do once you're done with all the settings the details rules and the options click on save and your new filter will be created on fraud filters now my shopify store has a filter and if anyone breaks this rule they will be blocked from my store and this is how easy it is to block customers and frauds on shopify I hope that I was a big help. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Turn on bell notification and subscribe to Software Made Easy.